So do our dreams actually mean anything? Um, listen, dreams can provide some insight into what's going on with you subconsciously, but they are not straightforward uh, and there's no one way to interpret them. So that's the trick. You know, dreams are a way that we deal with underlying concerns, desires, fears, unresolved issues that are going around in our subconscious mind. So in that sense, yes, they are, they do have meaning. However, it is hard to um, derive universal meaning, right? There's a lot of like dream analysis, but um, the, you know, that's using metaphors. If you dream about a spider, spiders, then you're having issues with your mother figure. Well, that is, that's a, an interpretation of that dream, but that is by no means universal. And our dreams are often chaotic and random. And so it can be very hard to know what to draw from them. And you have to just use your universe, your individual, you know, analysis. I, I think that personally, I think that, you know, we can understand a lot of themes. You know, we know that, um, we often dream about things that are straightforward, right? Like you may have the, um, something happening at work dream, or you may have that kind of common dream where you are um, naked somewhere and embarrassed. And, you know, of course that probably doesn't mean that you are afraid of showing up naked somewhere, but it probably does mean that you have some sort of insecurity that is festering in your subconscious mind. So beyond that, when we get into very sort of literal interpretations, um, and there are many books on this, I am personally pretty skeptical about that. I think that symbolism is something that humans, we, we create those connections, we create that symbolism. We say, oh, well, this means this, but that's gonna change across cultures and age groups and you know where you're from in the world. Uh, you know, a symbol, something that is symbolic to you know, most Americans may not be the same to people who are living in China. They may have completely different associations with that object or that thing or that color, for example. So I'm a little skeptical about being able to derive specific meanings, but yes, it is our way of dealing with emotions and desires and needs and fears in our subconscious mind.